Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Rewind here, and welcome back to another YouTube video. And in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the updates that occurred on Tuesday morning. I'm pretty sure. Well, this isn't the right thing. Um, let's go into news. Right here, the scope of all we're gonna be taking a look at, as long as some many other changes that have occurred during this, and some other new items that they did add, and some map changes and playgrounds. That's probably the easiest way to do it. So yeah, let's hop right into a match, and let's see what's new. Okay, so the first thing we're going to take a look at is this um, ball above Polar Peak right here. See that right there? Yeah, so um, right above Polar, there's this ball right above where the sword used to be. And I'm still not sure what it is, but I noticed some effects when you get up close to it. First of all, I already did two some stuff to make sure what I, what I knew what I was doing, so I'm going to try to land on this ball. I didn't know the result already. Watch. Right in the middle, it just pushes you right off, and you get a foggy effect like that. And it's really, really weird, and, like, you can shoot at it and stuff. And, uh, yeah, I guess this actually leads me to another cool thing that they added into Fortnite. Right here, if I just come over to a flatter surface, they added gliders in. This isn't just in Playgrounds. They also added this into the real Fortnite, and this works like this. Put it this way. It's just, like, regularly to plug, except the number of gliders goes down, and once you run out, you're out. But, like... You, I spawn with them in playgrounds, but in regular regular game mode, you do not spawn with them, which kind of sucks. But you know, it's Fortnite, and I don't want it to be OP. Right. I think you should get like one free glider redeploy per game, not personally as many as you can find, because I'll show you guys where to find them next. But first of all, let's get focused on this giant cube above Polar Peak. Okay, you guys, and also you notice some weird noises that it's making, because I don't know why it does that, but it just does. So yeah, here we are, and you can't even look inside of it. It's just like. A swirl. I don't even know what the heck to call it, but yeah, it goes to a certain height. Yeah, so you can no longer build because of max build height right here. And yeah, you can't place like floors or anything. So yeah, do that I guess. And then oh, how did I not fall off of that? And I just I went into here. I just placed a whole bunch of stuff along here to make sure that we wouldn't fall. But yeah, when you get close to it for some reason, it does that. But I think this is something to do with the dragons, the dragon eggs that are in polar. But yeah, you can build underneath it, but you go blind like that for a little bit. This kind of sucks, but yeah, here we go. This should be good enough platform for it, and yeah. So it's really, really weird. I don't know why this is here, but if we just listen, and I'll be quiet for a little longer, it makes some noises. If you look at it, if you go right underneath it. Like, you can still kind of see. If you look up at it, you can see, but if you look down, you can't see anything. And I think it's because you're trying to see into the globe, but you can still jump underneath it. But yeah. The pick your pickaxe just acts like it's not even there, and I actually want to try something really quick. Yeah, you cannot build into it, dog, because of the build height. But it looks like if you could build into it, it would go through it. I don't know why. Yeah, and as you see, it glows red when you do that. It's really weird. Really weird indeed. So that's the first thing. I'm not sure if we can go into replay mode and do it, but yeah. So now I'm gonna go and try to find a new scope revolver and I'll come back to you guys once we do. Let's do this. Okay, so here are the new gliders, you guys. I'm not sure how many they can stack up. It looks like you can only oh. So you can only carry one set, so you can't carry multiple rows. So here's what they look like. They drop in piles of ten normally and they take up an inventory space, which doesn't make them too overpowered. So yeah, that's gliders for you. And yeah, I just need to I still haven't found the uh, revolver, or whatever the heck, the scope revolver, whatever. Okay guys, so after a while of searching, I decided to finally give up. I'm just gonna go into creative and show you guys later because it's been like um ten minutes since I last recorded and I still haven't found anything. But yeah, um so what I'm gonna I am gonna show you guys is the ammo. Notice anything different about it? It looks it actually has textures now, like shot this is all the ammo I'm pretty sure. Let me do just double check, yeah. Shotguns, snipers, heavy, shoddy, light ammo, medium ammo, and grenades slash rockets. Those are all the ammos, and they all look different, and I actually really like this now. It looks a lot nicer. I was wondering if they were ever going to get a texture. And also, the building looks a little different, as you see down there, where, like, I can choose what I want my keybinds, what platform I want to build. It's also different. It's more, like, highlighted and lit up, and there's also some other things I'm going to show you in Playground. So let's hop right into that right now. Okay, you guys. So I went to creative and built these couple of huts here. And I'm going to show you guys what's all new. So the most, the biggest thing about this update, obviously the new guns. The scope revolver comes in two different rarities. It comes in, oh, I can't see my colors now. It comes in gold and purple. Now, building damage, the gold, as of now, 
for at least metal does. Let's see, let's do some quick maths here. 44 damage. Now for wood, I probably should let it finish. I'll let that finish. I'm gonna let this build in the meantime. For wood, it also does 44 damage. So I think they all do 44. Okay, they all do 44 damage. Why didn't I know that? And now for the purple one, it does 32 damage. No, it does 42 damage. 42 damage to buildings. Yep. And that's the new that's the new revolvers. That's both of their damages. Let's repair these. And also, um, they cut. Okay, so their damage. Right here, damage is 44. Damage per second is 70. Fire rate is 1.6. Magazine is 6. Reload times 2. Right here, it's 42 damage. So I guess it's pretty much the same thing. Maybe I did my math wrong on the building ones, but I don't know. This is an 88 headshot, and I believe this is an 84 headshot. Or no. Yeah, it's one of those two. Because I haven't done too much research on these. But yeah, here's what the sculpts look like. The hip fire is also almost dead on. Amazing. And yeah, the sights zoom in like this, and you aim at your character. Got them, just like a scope they are. Okay, next building. As you see, stink bombs. Regular stink bombs, right? Wrong. As you see now in my inventory, they are blue, which is not normal. Blue right there. Stink bomb. Rare. Rarity is rare. Ranged weapon. Damage is 5.0 still. I just they changed the rare disease because. I am glad that they did, honestly, because they are becoming a lot more common. I'm pretty sure they didn't nerf any of the throwing things, but yeah. They, they were a lot more common, and I don't think they should have been purple. So that's one thing that they changed. Another thing is balloons. They are also now blue rarity. Which is, I mean, I guess that's good too. I see a lot more balloons, and I'm actually kind of glad they changed the rarity of this. And then also in here, I already talked about these briefly, but gliders, as you know, here's a good way to use gliders if you don't already know, which most of you probably did. Go up to max height, and yeah, you don't even need to have them in your hand. And I'll get rid of these balloons, just... And yeah, you could use it and it deploys it. And now I'm not sure if there's an undeploy on these, but I've checked from a higher distance, I'm pretty sure that there isn't. And these aren't as good, you go slightly slower than a regular glider. I guess, yeah, okay, I, I guess my height is not but yeah, I'm pretty sure there's no redeploys. And also, the last thing I want to talk about is right in here, is mini. This is kind of annoying. Like how they nerfed the big pots, I mean, not nerfed it, buffed it, and now they can carry three. These are all stacks of minis, it's six, six, ready? See, six minis right there. Now watch them pick up another one. They only stack in sixes now, not tens. Which I also strongly don't like, because minis are really good, and I hate to have less of them. But yeah, you can still carry them on, but I do not like how they change the amounts of that stuff at all. I think they should have kept it at 10. I don't know why they changed it. Hopefully, they'll bring it back. I'm not sure, though. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. If you enjoyed, please smash the like button down below and subscribe for more Fortnite videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And yeah, I had to record this on Tuesday to start with the videos. Not the 100% best quality in the heckin' world. Yeah, whatever. I'll see you guys next time. Have a wonderful day. Bye, y'all.